past couple of weeks. Oh, busy for buyers. It's been, <laughs> it's been crazy for buyers. Trying to find houses for people, there's way more people buying than are selling. Everybody knows this from the news. But um, we've been having situations where people are hundreds of thousands overvalued, not just over asked. So it's not a situation where people are just mm. underpricing and selling yeah. at value. Now we're finding that people are paying way over value. So that's the increase we're going to be reporting yeah. back in the summertime when we're talking about the spring market. And I think it's different, like it's different than people are saying, oh, it's 2017 all over again. I think it's different. I think people are valuing kind of their home space a little bit more. There's a different focus on the commodity of real estate as part of your personal value. I think it's a little bit different that way. And um, yeah, the, the win is getting the house. It's not what price you get it for, the win is getting that house. It seems to be now. And the next rush, people are talking about the rates bringing the prices down. Rates going up, affordability going up, going down rather, and the price is dropping. There's too many factors. Yeah. I don't see it. It would have to be a drastic increase in rates right now. I think a drastic increase in product on the market would change things. That's like the only if we thing. saw it, yeah, because it's supply and demand, right? It always comes back to supply and demand. We're gonna have a lot more demand. Mm -hmm. Do you have a supply of red wine in there or coffee? <laughs> <laughs> I think experience counts in this market no matter what. If you're an agent, I could not imagine being new, starting out in this market. It would be so hard. Having favors from other agents is so important right now. And not like unethical favors, but just like people calling and saying, hey, I've got this property listed. I know you have a buyer, like that's what. I'll take whatever favors I can. No. Being in a position right now where you have those relationships, the past relationships with other agents that you can bring your people to the table and have that edge. Oh my gosh. Absolutely essential. Yeah, it's like it is such a business built on relationships, not just with our clients, but with other agents to, to walk in the door cold and be a new agent and not have that established relationship. So people know if we bring an offer, it's going to complete. We know the agents who come to us, who are reputable, who have experience, it's going to work and out. And the other ones. And the other ones, <laughs> yes. Yeah, cheers. Coffee and conversation.